information about the marks scored by 220 candidates in an examination is shown in the incomplete table and incomplete histogram so you have been given the marks and some frequencies there are some missing frequencies and you need to complete the table and the histogram so we have a histogram which we need to complete now what is frequent how do you calculate frequency density so for frequency density calculation I'll just write down here that will be frequency density what we are going to calculate here the frequencies there are two frequencies missing which we need to find out so frequency density is equal to frequency divided by class width frequency divided by class width so now we are just going to write down the class width first so I'll write down the class width here itself so what will be the class width for this one for the first interval the class width is the difference between the upper limit and the lower limit that's the uh, 25 minus 0 so 25 minus 0 that's that's what we are going to write 25 minus 0 which is equal to 25 for this limit now 50 minus 25 will give you 25 and for this one it's 70 minus 50 so we are just going to write down 70 minus 50 which is equal to 20 and for this one it's 80 minus 70 that's 10 right and for this one it's 100 minus 80 that's equal to 20 so we have got the class width of these intervals now we need to find out the frequency density frequency density as I already told you is frequency divided by the class width so let's see frequency divided by the class width so 25 divided by 25 so you have 25 divided by 25 that's equal to 1 for this one and here 75 divided by 25 so that's equal to 3 3 25s make 75 and then here you don't have the frequency so we cannot find out because first we need to find out the frequency and that's even not given in the histogram now 44 so this one will calculate 44 divided by 10 which equals 4.4 right so i'll just move the camera so 100 minus 80 so you got 20 so you don't have the frequency let's see if we have it in the histogram for 80 to 100 it's given uh, point 0.1 point 0.2 point 0.3 so we are just going to take that so it will be frequency density is frequency divided by class width so frequency we don't know so frequency divided by the class width is 20 and the frequency density is given as 0 0.3 so eventually you'll get frequency density is 0.3 so i'll just write down 0.3 and you can find out the frequency from that that's 20 multiplied by 0.3 that's equal to 6 so we have got the frequency here the frequency here is 6 and the re there's one more frequency that's missing so now we know that the total here is 220 as told in the question there are 220 candidates so we're just going to add up all of them that's 25 plus 75 25 plus 75 plus let it be x we don't know plus 44 plus 6 so we'll just take down 25 plus 75 plus x plus 44 plus 6 equals 220 so x will be equal to uh, all you need to do is you need to add all of them and then subtract it from 220 and what you're going to get is 
x equals to 70 so the missing frequency which is there it's 70 so you can find out the frequency density now 70 divided by 20 so we have the frequency density as 3.5 so we have 1 3 3.5 4.4 .4, and 0 0.3 as the frequency densities now we can plot it on the histogram so we are just going to label this is 0.5 1 1.5 2 2.5 3 3.5 uh, this is 4 then you have 4.5 and 5 so now we have uh, updated the frequency densities now from 0 to 20 I'll just check from 0 sorry it's from 0 to 25 from 0 to 25 your frequency density is 1 so that's that's what we have equated to the frequency density is 1 so it should be accurate otherwise you lose marks so I think we can use scale so that's 1 all right, so now from 25 to 50, so from this interval, 25 to 50, your frequency density is 3, so we have marked at 3. That's already marked 50 to 70. Now for 50 to 70, your frequency density is 3.5, so it's marked at 3.5 from 50 to 70. Yes, I think we need to mark it at 3.5 that's that's the frequency density what we got so it will be up here yes like this all right so next from 70 to 80 70 to 80 we have the frequency density as 4.4 so we have at 4.4 that's marked here yes that's 4.4 at 4.4 and from 80 to 100 it's already marked at 0.3 so we have drawn the histogram and the table is completed all right guys thank you so much bye bye take care